Hello, everybody. I hope that you're doing well. I want to come back on and give you the update on the Utah Amber Alert. I let you know that I would come back if they did any modification or adding on any details to the alert, and they have. So um, it's really important nah, that you guys know what's going on. This is this is pretty scary. And so for those of you that this may your, be your first time hearing about it, it's a non-family abduction. It is out of Layton. And a 13-year-old child communicated with an adult suspect via internet and left his home to meet late Monday night. Suspect and victim may be en route to Arizona or Texas. Suspect and victim are not related. And the suspect also goes by Tadishi Kojima is one name, Hunter Wolf or Hunter Fox. And so I had suspected this earlier that Hunter Fox may not have been his real name. And so those are some of the names that he's gone by. Um, I will show you if you look on the right here, it states that his real name is Aaron Zeman and his date of birth is April 6th, 1996. He is in fact 26 years old and he is a white male. They have now come out with information on the vehicle. It is a white 1998 Toyota Avalon. There is no front grill, damage to the front end, tinted windows, and it is a Arizona license plate number 222255NP. And the victim is Evan. He is just a 13 year old boy. He is a white male, five foot three, 110 pounds, with brown hair and brown eyes. He is wearing a black windbreaker with a hood, a white t shirt with blue and yellow bunny skull and bones logo on it. He has blue and gray sweatpants on with black van shoes with yellow Cobra Kai emblem and also an olive beanie with the same logo as the shirt. And that would be the blue and yellow bunny skulls and bones logo. And I'm going to also take you over to a video that gives some new information and it's it's rather concerning. It's I'm I'm very concerned about this because um, hmm, the police had a heads up on this prior to it happening, so that's pretty upsetting. And uh, and I know the boy was asked to take his his passport with him. Those are huge red flags, you guys. This is really scary. Um, everybody needs to keep their eyes out. We start Fox 13 News at 9 with breaking news of an active Amber Alert for a missing 13-year-old from Layton who you see on the left. Police believe the teen may have been abducted by a 25-year-old man on the right who is not related to him. Thanks for joining us. I'm April Baker filling in for Bob and Kelly tonight. Fox 13 News reporter Jenna Breed joins us live now from Layton. And Jenna, what can you tell us about the ongoing search? That's right, April. Layton police believe 13-year-old Evan McConney was kidnapped by a man he was talking to online, 25-year-old named Hunter Fox. I spoke with a close friend of Evan's mom who says the family desperately needs the public's help in getting Evan home safe as soon as possible. It's gut-wrenching. I, I cannot imagine as a parent not knowing where my child is sleeping tonight and Beth Cooper describes Evan McConney as a handsome, brilliant young man. He comes from a very loving household, a safe environment. He's grown up with two loving parents his entire life. This just isn't one of those scenarios that he's trying to run away from a bad home. He was manipulated by someone pretending to be someone they were not. Tuesday morning, Evan's parents told Layton police their son went missing overnight. The fact that the child's 13, if, if he left with this adult without the parents' consent, that's kidnapping. Lieutenant and Travis Lyman says Evan's parents had reported to police 
that their son was talking to the 25 year old suspect Hunter Fox a few weeks ago. It really does become our highest priority uh, when a child is is missing like this. Um, we're doing everything we can uh, on every front to try and try and find him. Cooper says Fox asked Evan to bring his passport, which he did. So although police believe the pair could be here in Utah, in Arizona or in Texas, they could be anywhere. You have an older man posing to be someone else, confusing a 13 year old minor things that he's not aware of in life. He doesn't understand yet why when somebody asks you to leave your house, you don't go. Layton police ask you call them or 911 if you have any information on Evan's whereabouts. Evan's family is asking everyone to share his photos on social media and with your friends and family in other states. Reporting live in Layton, Jenna Bree, Fox 13 News, Utah. Yeah, so you see, this is this is very scary. This is definitely an emergency, and um, it, they claim that he absolutely may be in danger. And I can definitely see now, with even further, why why that is. And so, please, uh, I will make a community post as well. Um, please share this out or share the community post out and get the word out to everybody of this suspect and what is going on so that we can get Evan back home safely to his parents. Uh, I will contact, uh, I will uh, update this and let you guys know if in fact they make contact with the suspect and the victim and let you know the update on it or if more information comes out that um, I need to update for you, I will do that as well. So uh, keep an eye out and I will talk to you all very, very soon. Thank you everyone.